The Industrial Revolution of 1760 brought the discovery and invention of many wonderful and useful things, one of which is fossil fuel. Fossil fuel is extremely useful, especially when combusted, as it releases energy that can be converted like its use in cars, locomotives, planes, and ships, where the heat energy released by the combustion of fossil fuel is converted into mechanical energy allowing them to move. Fossil fuels also have their uses in electricity production. Fossil fuel power plants burn coal or oil which generates steam. The steam then in turn rotates a turbine turning mechanical energy into electric energy. But is humanity's greatest ally turning against us? And what can we do about it? <laughs>
making some part of the fluid into steam. This geothermal power plant uses crystallizer, reactor clarifier technology, a process that turns the geothermal superheated fluid into steam while removing solids from it. The superheated fluid goes into surface pipelines and into a wellhead separators. The pressure of the superheated fluid is reduced, which causes it to rapidly vaporize into high-pressure steam. The geothermal liquid that has not been flushed goes into a second vessel, called the standard pressure crystallizer, where standard pressure steam is produced. Next is the low pressure crystallizer, and the remaining fluid is again flushed but at a lower pressure that produces low pressure steam. The high pressure, standard pressure, and low pressure steams are delivered to a large turbine. This rotates the turbine, directly connected to an electrical generator, turning the mechanical energy of the turbine into electric energy. The electrical energy generated is then carried to a step-up transformer outside the tank. The transformer then transfers the power into power lines which carry it into homes and businesses. The steam used to turn the turbine is then condensed, collected, and return underground along with the remaining water from the valves. Geothermal energy sourcing is good for the environment. First and foremost, geothermal energy is extracted from the earth without burning fossil fuels and geothermal fields produce practically no emissions. What's more, Geothermal energy can be very beneficial as you can achieve savings of up to 80% over conventional energy usage. High Efficiency of Geothermal Systems Geothermal heat pump systems use 25% to 50% less electricity than conventional systems for heating or cooling and with their flexible design, they can be adjusted to different situations, requiring less space for hardware as opposed to conventional systems. Environmental Concerns About Greenhouse Emissions Unfortunately, no matter its reputation of being an environmentally friendly alternative energy source, geothermal energy also causes some minor concerns in regards to the environment. The extraction of geothermal energy from the grounds leads to release of greenhouse gases like hydrogen sulfide, carbon dioxide, methane, and ammonia. However, the amount of gas released is significantly lower than in the case of fossil fuels. Geothermal plants can cause earthquakes. Constructing a geothermal power plant involves drilling deep within the earth to release hot steam and or water chopped in rock formations. This process has been known to cause instability underground, which can lead to earthquakes at the surface of the earth. Additionally, geothermal power plants can cause slow land subsidence over time as geothermal reservoirs are depleted. Conclusion, harnessing geothermal energy presents many advantages and dangers. If we want to completely discard the use of harmful fossil fuels, we must support the development of these cleaner energy sources. Truth be told, geothermal energy alone cannot fulfill the ever-growing demand of humanity for energy. Because its sources are scarce and expensive, but if we act now and start developing and using the alternative renewable energies, we must might begin to slowly heal our wounded, suffocating world.